Teresa, obviously family is extremely important to you given who you're sitting next to, but you know, I've been reading about your story, your parents' journey from Jamaica and Trinidad, you know, your, your, your relationship with your mother and, and her battle with, with cancer, and just how your business has been interwoven with your family so deeply. Mm -hmm. For entrepreneurs out there, what role does family play in, in your success? Well, it's big. So both of my parents were immigrants. My father's from Trinidad, Tunapuna, and my mother's from Jamaica, Constant Springs, and they came here, obviously, as immigrants, and they have earned their citizenships. Um, we, when my mother was battling cancer, which was really big to us, Kayla and I did not discover that Italian ice cream is the only thing that she can eat in her final days. That was very important to us. Our product is gluten-free, dairy-free, cholesterol-free, soy-free. And we also, Kayla is a culinary. I keep saying Kayla because I'm not domesticated. I don't really cook. But <laughs> Kayla's really good in the kitchen, just to give y'all an FYI. So she found a way to make some of our products all natural. Mm -hmm. right. And so with that being said, that instead she used like turmeric. Um, and carrots and spinach for some of our different products. And that's very important. So all of our items are not all natural. We're working on that as we go about, but we do have some that really means a lot to me. When my daughter came to me with this idea, she was passionate. She was like, Mom, I got $100. No, first she says, Mom, I want a tie and see in Atlanta. And I'm like, that's great. We all want something. <laughs> like, what do you want to do for you? And if you ever been in a African-American household and you come with an idea to your parent, the first thing I'm going to ask you, well, where's your money? Like, how are we supposed to start this? And so she did. She came down with this little Ziploc bag full of all these quarters and dollars, and we added it up. It was $100. And she says, is this enough? And I said, no. But the <laughs> fact that you were willing to be your first investor into your own brand. Yeah. So I hope that answers your question. She had a need, she had a dream, and I wanted to support her. So I am her first supporter. And her family and my friends, I can't leave them out. Her dad, everyone is very supportive of her in her journey. And we appreciate Yay. you. Mm -hmm.